Hogwarts Legacies, Flying Mounts, and Dark Arts Battle Arena set a dangerous precedent. In a setting that sees people duel with wands, conjure charms with ease, and find new, interesting locations that have magical and historical meaning, it's important to make the game's mechanics and features feel accessible. Nobody wants a game that emphasizes the use of spells and other unrestricted activities only to be met with invisible walls. Hogwarts Legacy will make the Dark Arts Battle Arena and mounts like Hippogriffs available only on the deluxe version of the game, and people who opt for the standard copy will have to purchase it as an optional extra. Hogwarts Legacy hosts a variety of battle arenas for you to try out your dueling prowess, but those pre-ordering the digital deluxe edition of the game will get to go to an extra arena, the Dark Arts Arena. Alongside two normal combat areas, this one carries a darker aesthetic, an excellent place to practice unforgivable curses, you might say. Indeed, you get to see Avada Kedavra enacted in this preview, and it should come as no surprise that the killing curse obliterates your opponent's health bar immediately. But the magic you can perform in Hogwarts Legacy goes deeper than the spells we learned about in Harry Potter's era. Ancient magic can be performed during your battles, and it does an awful lot of damage too. We can't wait to learn more about it. There are also certain potions or magical plants you can brew or grow to add depth to your battling techniques. For example, you could put down some venomous tentacular or mandrix if you wanted to live out your best Professor Sprout battle vibe. This is frustrating, in large part because it's a feature that will be developed, polished, and available day one, but only on the condition that it is additionally purchased. It's not like it's a future update that will release after the game launches, it's simply limited to a specific, more expensive version of the title. The Dark Arts Battle Arena looks like a lot of fun and a great way for gamers to hone their skills in combat. Using the Killing Curse in a video game is something that players perhaps wouldn't want to admit they've had a hankering to do, and knowing that this won't be possible with the base game is a shame. Hogwarts Legacy releases on February 10, 2023, for PC, PS5, and Xbox Series X S on April 4, 2023, for PS4 and Xbox One, and on July 25, 2023, for Switch.